The Travis Mannion Foundation starts with a story. The story of a Marine's courage, a mother's undying love for her son, to continue his legacy of service. And a simple request from Travis's former high school for his family to share his story with their students. That single request became a spark that ignited a movement. One request led to another and another, and soon students across the country were hearing stories of service and sacrifice, breathing inspiration into the next generation of American leaders. This became the Foundation's hallmark program for you, Character Does Matter, that continues to this day. Thousands of veterans and families of the fallen now serve as mentors, teaching about character traits like courage, integrity, and humility, providing a pathway for students to serve in their own communities, and always beginning with a story and always honoring those who have sacrificed for our nation. And as the program grew, Something profound happened to the people sharing these stories. Veterans and survivors felt a renewed sense of purpose, once again serving a cause greater than themselves. They found meaning in paying their service forward, sharing lessons learned and pouring their experience into a mission that mattered. Soon, a community was formed. They became more than volunteers. They were Spartans. An identity built upon a passion for servant leadership, a desire to honor the fallen, and a commitment to strengthening communities and building a stronger nation. Programs were developed to serve the leaders who fuel our mission, investing in veterans and survivors and empowering them to navigate their next chapter, addressing the needs of the local community through service, connecting people to one another through a common sense of gratitude for those who have worn our nation's uniform. One story, the source of so much impact, channeling one's family loss into one of the largest veteran service organizations in the country. A mission as bold as the leaders who fuel it, inspiring a nation to answer the five words that became a movement, if not me, then who?